Hi everyone. We hear a lot about it's about the journey, not the destination. And it's always about the doing and the process more than the result itself. Well, since forever, I truly believed in that. But to be honest, since now, it is the right the time that uh, I felt the accuracy of this. I am here to share part of my story with you. And let me begin with a story. Allow me to take you back in time when I first graduated from Sultan Qaboos University. <laughs> now, usually colleges and universities provide sort of cocoon, a community of friends, colleges, colleges advisors, and teachers. While graduating, consider it to be a leap into adulthood. You go from grades you need to earn, exams you need to pass, and clear schedules into a full world of uncertainty. Graduates usually go through an endless loop of job searching, starting from searching, applying, and waiting. And for majority, this quite take longer than expected. Statistics has shown that career and academic factors are, sec are the second biggest source of stress for youth. And usually, uh, this endless loop of job searching it opens doors for self-doubt to knock in, making them questioning their capabilities and abilities, raising the biggest question, am I ready for this? Uh, I mean, who here feels that they were fully prepared for their job once they graduated? And I think at that stage, at that moment, camping at the zone of fears and uncertainty, the platform came to life. Now, if we went back in time further, in 18, 18, 1885 exactly, a German psychologist called Hermann Ebbinghaus did a study of the mind. And what he did, he plotted the results in a curve and he called it the forgetting curve. And it actually shows how learners rapidly forget information if there was no attempt to retain it or apply it. Usually, our brains operate in use it or lose it strategy. It is usually, you need to enhance the stickiness of the information in order to have it forever. It is actually like a planting, uh, watering a plant. If you didn't do it regularly, you might lose it forever. But if you kept doing it all over again, and kept doing it, it will, it will grow uh, very strong roots, and you will continue to have it forever. That's what happens to the majority of the graduates. They usually get uh, so, uh, so busy with the hectic life of searching for the job and getting uh, busy, scared of, and having the fear of the uncertainty. They forget the biggest part, that they need to apply what they have learned. They have to take the knowledge into the practice. And when we created our solution, we really wanted to work on that. We wanted to be the first step for graduates to apply whatever they have learned and enhance their knowledge horizon by bringing whatever they, they took throughout the journey and their universities into practice and into the real world. So our platform basically uh, joins um, graduates with part-time jobs and task-based task jobs in order for them to have a better portfolio and a better career path. The world is rapidly growing, and skills are rapidly growing with it as well. When we created our solution, we really wanted it to be a solution that helps and bridge the gap between us. We wanted to meet the supply and demand and gather it together and help to match these two together. Now, establishing the journey of establishing a startup is, is quite hard. But at the same time, you need to understand that what drives entrepreneurs the most is uh, embracing the conflicts and also having the passion continuously to do it. It's usually an ongoing process of learning and learning and meeting most of the mentors and advisors to understand more in order to provide a valuable product for the clients. But it's not a smooth ride. It's usually a bumpy ride, and you will end up looking like this. Most of the time, not knowing where to go, hearing a lot of feedbacks, and listening to a lot of uh, people. At the end, all of this, it will help you to find the right path to reach to your clients. Uh, now, I want to end my, my presentation with a, with, a, with a quote that I believe in. A wise man once said, it's not about, life is not a problem that you need to solve, but it is an experience to be lived. And this experience, the falls, it's what make up the journey. 
it is about the unknown and yet to come and the bumpy ride that you go through. And at the end, it is your choice. So what will you choose? Thank you.